first of all, the components. Skeletal muscles are made up of fascicles, bundles of skeletal muscle fibers. Myofibrils are composed of protein subunits called myofilaments. Myofilaments are made up of thin and thick bands called actin and myosin. Troponin is a complex protein that is attached to the actin. To begin muscle contraction, a nerve impulse is sent from the brain and reaches the neuromuscular junction. Then, acetylcholine, a chemical signal, is released in response. After the muscle is stimulated, the sarcoplasmic reticulum, a specialized type of smooth ER, regulates the calcium ion concentration in the cytoplasm of the striated muscle cell. This calcium binds to the troponin on each actin filament. Myosin heads are what link the thick and thin filaments together during contraction. At this point, the heads at the end of the myosin want to connect to the actin filaments. The myosin heads are eventually able to connect to the actin and then pull the filaments together to contract the muscle. The calcium then disconnects from the troponin and is released. The myosin heads then disconnect from the actin strand. Finally, the muscle returns to resting position for the process to repeat each time a nerve impulse is sent from the brain. Myosin heads. <laughs> so we'll cut it out. We'll cut it out.